Southern France, the 1960s. Eugène, a French-Italian teenager, is on his way to Bordeaux to visit his uncle Flavio, a man he believes works in an antique shop. On arrival, he has several rude revelations. Flavio is really a guard for a brothel, he is currently locked up for a fight, and the other man in that altercation has just turned up dead. But that's just the beginning of the mystery. It is the south of France during the height of the French connection. Everyone has secrets, and silence is a way of life. Chronique de Silence, or Chronicle of Silence, is a detective-themed adventure game. Eugène, a natural-born detective, finds himself drafted into investigations into different figures around Bordeaux. Eugène carries a tape recorder which he uses to record conversations, and the goal is to comb through those discussions in hopes of finding information between the lines. There are several stages to each investigation. After speaking with a person of interest, Eugène can compare what they said to physical evidence to reveal contradictions. Having done that, he then must deduce the motives and drives of the people involved to make an accusation. Each step has a minigame attached to it, which makes the process interesting, though the sheer quantity of information can make it frustrating as well. One of the more distinctive features of Chronique de Silence is its art style. Most of the game features a colorful, if somewhat flat, presentation, but this is broken up with fully animated cutscenes that are a nice change of pace. Combined with the personalities that Eugène must contend with, it does a good job of capturing the feel of that time and place. Overall, Chronique de Silence will appeal more to fans of the burgeoning detective game subgenre than to fans of conventional adventure games.